This next data set is a set of data that I collected from my students as a survey in the first week. Now this is their sanitised data where I've removed uh, the times that they submitted things and I've also uh, cleared up some of the confusing entries. Uh, so for example estimate, uh, lots of people didn't put as a percentage, they put all sorts of different numbers. So this is the nice tidy uh, clean set of data. So what I want to do here is demonstrate how you can count frequencies. So I want to know how many people support Labour, how many people support Conservative. So to get that summary chart, I go to Analyze, I go to Descriptive Statistics, and I get Frequencies. And I pick the columns that I want people who want to count. So I can find out how many people are male and female, how many people said they preferred not to say. And I can find out about their political views. I can find out how many people support each of the different parties. So if I go here, I find that I've got 172 women. Sorry, in total, I've got 223. I've got no missing values. That's important always to check. I've got 172 women. 49 men, one non-binary person, one person who preferred not to say. In political views, I've got 22 Conservative, 5 Greens, 142 Labour supporters, 14 Liberal Democrats and 40 people who fall into the other category. This is large because a lot of the students might be international students, so they do not associate with the regular British parties. 